All right, folks. I just called the uh, local lumber yard where I get all my stuff at. Two before, 16 foot long, $20 is what he'll sell them to me at right now. The last they had bought was back in uh, December, and I think they were a little bit cheaper then, but he bought the, the last bundle was uh, January the 24th, or the last, you know, truckload, and they're $20 a piece. Look at this right here. So this is why I went out yesterday and went to cut. And he's That's probably right. gonna have to talk a little louder because it's raining and you can hear it on that tin roof. Yeah. Well, Look I at Merle go. Here. I went back here and we got planted timber back here. So I went and cut a bunch of uh, bunch of pine logs and I'm cutting two batins. Two batins, the, the last ones that they bought was like, oh, $30 a piece for two batins, 16 foot long. And when they have to reorder, when they run out and reorder, then those will probably be like 60 because I just told him while ago, I said, well, I could take two batins, bring them here and cut and save $10. You know, I could cut two out of one two batin, two two by fours out of one two batin and be money ahead. He said, yeah, that's because we ordered them back when stuff was low. But the prices of this stuff is going out of sight. Going up. Yeah. This is my sawmill puppy right here. He helps me out. Well, look at this stack right here that I've cut out of. I think that's four logs. I think I've cut four logs. And I cut one of them into two by 10, 16. And there's nine, let's see. That's 45. That's 45 two by four, 16 foot, and I'm cutting them inch and a half by three and a half like you get them from the uh, mill, and then that way if I do have to buy some or whatever, then they'll match up. But you can cut them whatever you want to on this thing right here. You can cut them two by four or whatever. But uh, look at that right there. I mean, that's, that's crazy. And that's 30 bucks right now. That's the best price <clears throat> that I can find on that two by 10 right there is 30 bucks. A piece. Tw yeah, a piece. 20 on this. So 45 times 20 is what, $900? You know I don't do math, I don't know. It's a lot. That's $900 worth of wood right there. That that's is, sad that that's all $900 will get you right that's, now. That's though. ridiculous, ridiculous. I just, mm, there ain't no way. I mean, I don't see how people are building houses right now, even with the interest rates as low as they are right now. Merrill, I don't know what you're rolling in, but stop. Boy. But this is the rainy day stuff. We we started and starting the house. We've got the foundation. Oh, me and Hannah did the digging, the pouring, and all that right there. And now they're laying blocks. And now they're laying blocks. So we're getting. <coughs> uh, we're waiting on him to lay block. And of course, today with the rain and the freezing and all that stuff right there, it's hard to do. So he's a little bit behind, and we'll get you caught up on the videos on that. But uh, while it was raining and I was waiting on him, I just went to sawing logs back here yesterday and you say i've loaded the ramp and i've still got probably two or three more pretty good loads back there to get out oh, that i did cut yesterday and i'm gonna we're gonna try to build a cabin little a-frame cabin on a, uh, on a lot on the river and uh, that's what this is gonna be for is that but i thought we'd get y'all caught up hadn't posted anything in a in a you know in what a week or so since last week Thought I'd get y'all caught up. That's what we're working on right here is getting these things cut. Yep. Saving money. I guess we're saving money anyway. We're trying. Gas and blades are cheap. You can get these blades. I think they're twenty dollars a piece, and I'll run them. I'll run them three, three different sharpening. So, you know, you can probably figure cutting at least fifteen hundred board foot with one blade, and it costs twenty dollars. You just I just resharpen it and. It don't take long to do that either. Reset the teeth and hub it back up in one of these logs and keep on going. But about about a hundred, about fifteen hundred foot, and then it'll you know a lot of times they'll they'll pop. They just get stressed. But uh, anyway, get y'all caught up. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate y'all.